Developing a pricing strategy for your game requires careful consideration of various factors, including production costs, target market, competition, perceived value, and revenue goals. Here's how to develop an effective pricing strategy for your game. Understand your costs. Calculate the total production costs associated with developing, marketing, and distributing your game. This includes expenses such as development team salaries, software licenses, marketing campaigns, localization, platform fees, and any other overhead costs. Determine your break-even point and set a minimum price that covers your costs while still allowing for a reasonable profit margin. Research the market. Conduct market research to understand pricing trends, consumer preferences, and competitor pricing strategies within your target market. Analyze similar games in terms of genre, scope, quality, and pricing to identify pricing benchmarks and competitive positioning. Consider factors such as the perceived value of your game, its unique selling points, and the level of demand within your target market when determining your pricing strategy. Define your pricing objectives. Clearly define your pricing objectives and revenue goals for your game. Determine whether your primary focus is on maximizing revenue, gaining market share, building brand awareness, or achieving other strategic objectives. Align your pricing strategy with your broader business goals and consider how pricing decisions will impact your long-term profitability and sustainability. Segment your audience. Segment your target audience based on factors such as demographics, psychographics, purchasing behavior, and willingness to pay. Identify different customer segments with distinct needs, preferences, and price sensitivities. Tailor your pricing strategy to each audience segment, offering different pricing tiers, packages, or discounts to appeal to their specific needs and motivations. Choose a pricing model. Select a pricing model that aligns with the nature of your game, the preferences of your target audience, and your revenue objectives. Common pricing models for games include One-time purchase. Sell the game for a fixed price with no recurring charges. Free to play, freemium, offer the game for free with optional in-game purchases or microtransactions. Subscription, charge a recurring fee for access to the game or premium content on a monthly or annual basis. Pay what you want, PWYW, allow customers to pay any amount they choose for the game, often with a minimum price. Consider hybrid models or creative pricing structures that combine elements of different pricing models to maximize revenue and appeal to a wider audience. Set your price. Determine the optimal price point for your game based on a combination of factors, including production costs, market research, competitive analysis, and pricing objectives. Test different price points and pricing strategies through A, B testing or market experiments to assess their impact on sales volume, revenue, and profitability. Consider offering discounts, promotions, or limited time offers to stimulate demand, attract new customers, or reward loyal fans. Monitor performance and adjust as needed. Continuously monitor the performance of your pricing strategy and track key metrics such as sales volume, revenue, customer acquisition cost, CAC, and Customer Lifetime Value, CLV. Analyze the impact of pricing changes on customer behavior, market dynamics, and competitive landscape, and be prepared to adjust your pricing strategy accordingly. Stay agile and responsive to changes in the market, consumer preferences, and competitive pressures, iterating on your pricing strategy over time to optimize results and maximize profitability. By following these steps and considering factors such as costs, market research, pricing objectives, audience segmentation, pricing models, and performance monitoring, you can develop a pricing strategy that effectively positions your game in the market and drives sustainable revenue growth.